Hi guys, welcome back to my new video and today in this video, we will learn how to make an animated search box using HTML, CSS and JavaScript. Here you can see on my computer screen, I have created a search box which is similar to the Google search page. But I have added animation here. First you will only get the Google icon and if we click on this icon, it will expand the search box and it will add a voice search icon on the right side. When I click on this Google icon, it will collapse the voice search icon and input field. I have added beautiful shadow around the search box that makes this design more attractive. We will learn to make this animated search box design step by step using HTML, CSS and JavaScript in less than 10 minutes. So before starting this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel Easy Tutorials if you are new on my channel. Now let's start this video. Here I have this folder and in this folder I have added one HTML file and one CSS file and I have added two images. You can see this is the Google icon and this is the voice search icon. And now I will open these files with the text editor. So let me open my text editor which is brackets editor. So this is the HTML file where I have added the basic HTML structures like HTML head and body. This one is the CSS file where I have added margin padding and font family. In the HTML file I have added link tag and this Google font link. Now we will write the code in the body tag so here we will add one div with the class name hero. Now just copy this class name come to the CSS file write it here and here we will add the CSS properties like width and height. After that we will add the background and one color code here. It is similar to the white color. Then we will add the display flex align item center justify content center so that all the content in this div will be in the center. After that open this HTML file with browser. Now you can see this plain color on this web page. Let's come back to the HTML file and here we will create another div and let's add the ID here. So the ID I am adding search box. Here we will add one IMG. IMG and SRC. In this source we will write the Google image name which is google.png and let's add the ID. So the ID I am adding Google icon. After that we will add one input field. So let's add the input. Type will be text and we will add the placeholder. So the placeholder text is search google or type a URL. After that we will add one more icon which will be the mic icon. So here we will add the img tag and the image file name and one class name. So the class name I am adding mic icon like this. After adding this we have to design this one so just copy this id search box. Come to the CSS file write this id here with the hashtag. Here we will add radius it will be 55 pixel and let's add the padding 30 pixel. Then we will add the background the same color code that we have added in the complete web page. Then here we will add display flex align items center. After that we will add this id google icon write it here and for this icon we will set the size so I am adding width 50 pixel and let's add the cursor pointer. Now we have to set the size for the voice search icon so copy this class name write it here and here also we will add the width. So for this one we will add the width. 30 pixel. After adding this, we will refresh the website again and you can see this Google icon and this voice search icon and one input field between these icons. Now we have to design the search box so just come back and here let's add box shadow. We will add this box shadow here 6 pixel, 6 pixel, 10 pixel, minus 1 and let's add the color RGBA. 
triple zero and zero point one five. We will add one more shadow here, and it will be minus six, minus six, ten, and minus one. RGBA. Zero point seven. So we are adding two shadow here. Now we will refresh the website. Now you can see this shadow adds beautiful effect on this design. Next we have to design this input field. So let's come back and here we will add the input. For this one we will set the font size. It will be twenty pixel. Then we will add the width five hundred pixel and border. It will be zero. and let's add the background it will be transparent and outline will be none that's it after that you can see it is looking better now we have added all the things on this web page but next we have to collapse the search box and this why search icon for that we will come back to the css file and you can see we have added Input width here, width is 500 pixel. So for now we will make it zero. Width will be zero, and for this icon also we will add width zero like this. After that you can see we will only get the Google icon here because input box width is zero and the mic width is also zero. That's why we are only getting the Google icon. Now we have to add a click event on this one so that it will expand the search box. and it will add some width in the input field and mic icon so let's come back to the html file and come here we will add a script open and closing tag here we will add where and search box equal to document dot get element by id and here we will add this id search box copy this one and paste it here after that we will create one more variable and i will write google icon equal to document dot get element by id and again add this id google icon next we have to add the click event on this google icon so let's add google icon dot on click equal to function and we will write one code in this function that will be executed whenever we will click on the google icon so here we will add search box dot class list dot toggle and in this toggle we will add one class name so whenever we will click on the google icon it will add this class name and it will remove this class name so the class name i am adding active now we have to add css properties for this class so let's come to the css file here we will write active space input and here let's add the width 500 pixel now let's add the active class again then write mic icon and for this one also we will add width so it will be 30 pixel so whenever we will click on the google icon it will add the width in the mic icon and input field So let's come to the website again and if I click here you can see it will expand the search box. Right now you can see this input text and google icon very close to each other. So we have to add some padding. So let's add padding of 12 pixel and 20 pixel. Like this. And in this input we will add transition of 2 seconds and in this mic icon let's add the transition of 0.5 seconds and we will also add transition delay so the transition delay will be 0.5 seconds after applying these transitions and padding let's refresh the website again and now you can see if i click here it will expand the search box very smoothly and if i click again it will collapse this search box so it was very easy to create this type of collapsible search box using html css and javascript i hope this video will be helpful for you and if you have any question you can ask me in the comment section and please like and share this video and also subscribe my channel easy tutorials to watch more videos like this one thank you so much for watching this video